going to be trying the new NARS Soft Matte Foundation as well as the concealer. I mean, it ain't that new, but it's new to me. So we're going to call it new because... And that's what your girl got on today. And if you want to see my impression and how I applied it, then get one more. <laughs> Bro, what accent is that? <laughs> I also will be trying this beautiful Patrick Star palette that I got for Christmas. So yeah, you guys, if you want to see how I got this look with new products, then keep on watching. I'm so extra. <laughs> Usually I don't get matte foundation, but I probably should because I kind of have oily skin. So yeah, um, the box says a new take on matte, mm, comfortable. 16 hour wear full natural looking coverage true color oxidation true color oxidation resistant transfer proof shine proof okay so we're gonna see because transfer proof is kind of asking for a lot okay that means it won't get on my mask it won't get on my clothes it won't get on my boyfriend's clothes mm. So I got it in the color Tahoe, and that's the same color that I used for my other NARS foundation, the um, Natural Radiant Longwear one. And yeah, Tahoe. <laughs> Why did I just smack my face with it? I don't know, but yeah, I'm going to try this out today, you guys, and I'm going to see how I like the matte look. I also got the concealer. I got this in the color Biscuit, which... I'm pretty sure it's gonna be too dark but yeah I don't know why I got medium dark like does my skin look medium dark I don't think so but we're just gonna roll with it today you guys I've already made a mistake by getting possibly the wrong concealer but we're gonna just see how it turns out we're gonna just put that thing on there and see how it goes Bro, I always forget to prime my face, like, why? I literally always forget to prime my face because I'm an idiot. So we gonna just, we gonna prime around the part that I already freaking put on there. Is that a pros do it, right? That should be fine, fine. Now I will note that it is a soft mat. So we gonna see. Cause maybe the reason why I don't really use matte is cause it comes out looking a little crusty. But this is soft matte, so mm. it's gonna be just a little hint of crust or what. I mean, this is Tahoe. And this is 16 hour wear, like. 16 hours. I'm not going to be able to test that today, but I definitely will do a 16 hour test on this because your girl be oily after like five minutes. I start getting oily before I can even set my face. Foundation is laid like. So now I'm going to go in with the concealer. And it's really cute. What would you even call this? I feel like I'm going blank right now. I don't even know what to call this. A pot. It's in like a little pot, you guys. And it's super cute. And you just take, you know, whatever brush you have to apply your concealer. Pick some up on it. And go to work, baby. We're going to get this. All concealed, baby. My 
as well use it as a highlight too, right? <laughs> Same boat, baby. It's probably not light enough to be a highlight shade, but that's okay. I can honestly say that both of these apply so good. And I do a lot of times have problems with texture and like my under eye. So honestly, this is like working out so well for me because I have like nothing no type of texture showing through it doesn't accentuate them so the base is all about that base about that base Okay, so now I'm gonna use my Laura Mercier translucent honey powder. Just take the unused part of my beauty blender. And set all those areas. Guys, I am like, <sighs> y'all see that base? Y'all see that base though. So now I'm gonna take the Sephora Micro Smooth and just set the rest of my face. I mean, honestly, y'all can see. Y'all see the face. Y'all see the base. <laughs> this looks <laughs> so good, you guys. I promise I will come back and do another video and I will wear it for 16 hours with the mask on, all that to test the wear time and the um, transfer proofness. We <laughs> the transfer proofness. <laughs> We gonna find out if it really is, and I'll be back to you guys to report. Cause right now it's looking like it might be a winner. I'm low key obsessed. I can't. I can't even do that. I'm low key obsessed, y'all. <laughs> Let me move on before I be sitting here for ten minutes, <laughs> wasting my camera's battery. Doing good and well. I got two bars. But yeah, you guys, I also have the Patrick Star Visionary Palette that I wanted to try out today. I'm just going to do a quick and simple look with this.
actually need to go to Sephora and get some more eyeliner, you guys, because I have, like, no eyeliner. And honestly, I don't even know what's the best eyeliner out there. If you guys have any suggestions, anything I should try, you know, because I've never stuck with, like, that's my go-to eyeliner. I used to use the little e.l.f. one that came in a pot and then it got like discontinued and then I used liquids here and there but my eyes be stupid sensitive like then I went to the pins but yeah if you guys have any eyeliner suggestions please let me know because I need some more eyeliner and I need a good one okay if it be like messing up your know, under eye and smearing and all that that's not the kind we're talking about, okay? We're talking about some nice, high-end. It's going to keep my wing on there all day. I'm not going to look up. It's not going to be way over here. Because <laughs> it got smeared. <laughs> I need me some good eyeliners, you guys. So, let me know in the comments, please. And I'm going to just add some lashes. And then I will be right back, you guys. Okay, guys. So, I am back with the extra lashes. My favorites. Eyelashes are just like... I don't know like a pair of shoes you guys like eventually you gotta grow out of them and get the bigger ones okay <laughs> but anyways you guys so now I'm going you know, I got eyelash glue all over my fingers for the struggle of applying your eyelashes who are y'all looking for I'm sorry guys, there's a helicopter going around my apartment right now. <laughs> Ooh, they circling the block looking for somebody. I'm gonna finish up doing my face. Um, I'm gonna contour right now. Made me lose what I was doing. Lose my chain of thought. I'm going to contour. I'm using the Radiant Creamy Concealer by NARS, and this is in the darkest color, um, dark coffee. Bro, I swear nothing blends like a beauty blender. I need like five of these things because I cannot. Any other brush, it just doesn't do it. When the base right, the face right, okay? And the base was laid, so the rest of the face is going to be slayed. <laughs> So now I'm going to take my Fenty Cream Blush in the shade Rose Latte. It's like the only blush I use because I love the cream formula. Now we're going to bronze the baby up. Bronze me up there. Bronze me up there. Bronze me up there. And this is the Fenty um, Sunstalker Bronzer in Island Ting. Now I'm going to go back in with the Patrick Star palette and I'm going to take the darkest shade that I used, Brownie. And I'm just gonna smoke out my lower lash line. 
Why am I using my big mirror right there? I'm gonna have to mirror right here, y'all. Get up close and personal. And we are almost done with this look, you guys. Super, <laughs> just mess that up. Super easy. <laughs> That's what I was about to say and I freaking messed it up. So that's what happens when you don't have a sharp pencil. I'm over here doing this with a dull old pencil. Okay. Now let's lash these babies up. Or mascara these babies up. And the base is still flawless, you guys. By now, I would have been freaking oil. But we over here. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Flipping my undone hair. <laughs> All right, you guys, for our final steps, I'm going to spray my face with this Urban Decay setting spray. And yeah. Jeez, that was a lot. <laughs> Put on my highlight after I spray my face down. Using this broken brush. But the brush still worked though. The brush still worked though. Hmm. Jeez. I don't know about y'all, but I know about it. I don't know about y'all, but this is looking. This is looking like something here. Wanna be starting something. Got to be starting something. So the lip today will be Chestnut by MAC. The usual, what I use like every day. <laughs> this it, this all. Chestnut by MAC, and then I'm going to use the ColourPop Ultra Bottled Lip in Starling and put my Fenty, Fenty Glow on top of that. So let's get that going. <laughs> what am I doing? Honestly, hate the period waiting for lipstick to get matte. <laughs> it's just how a fan and just. <laughs> You're waiting for it to get matte just to put gloss on top of it. Should I even add a gloss? I want you guys to tell me matte or glossy. I've always been a glossy girl. Glossy girl. Looks so pretty. Now this hair. It was my birthday, you guys. Today is 
the 10th. My birthday was on the 7th. I know, I know. I wasn't on here. I did not record my birthday, but I did go to dinner. It was cute. But yeah, this is how I have my hair for my birthday. Like I said, it's the 10th, so it's like three days old already. So your girl need a revamp. She need a revamp. Cause it's looking a little ragged and it's looking mm. so what I'm gonna do I don't really want to put any more heat on my hair because this is my hair um, but y'all can see I had the little curl the little curl the little curl going had the little curl so we just gonna we gonna leave it how it is because it got, it got a little a little curl and i don't want to keep putting the heat on my hair every day you know so so she gonna be all right like this for the day honestly i'm gonna just comb it because i have not tied this up and this hair is from eunice you guys i've had this for quite a while and none of these things have been sent to me. I have not been sent. No NARS. Okay. If you couldn't tell by how many subscribers I got. Ain't nobody sending your girl nothing. Yeah. Okay. 2021. I feel like it's going to be a good year for me. I feel like 2021 is going to be a good year for me, you guys. And yeah, we're just going to speak positivity into this world. Keep doing positive things like I do all the time. Think positive, be positive. And yeah, set goals for yourself, you know. It's like one of my goals for 2021 is to get to 10k subscribers by the end of the year. Now that sounds like a lot, but then when you think about how big social media is and how far it could take you. 10k should be attainable if i'm doing what i'm supposed to be doing so 10k is going to be the goal and you know if i reach 10k um during the course of 2021 then my goal is just gonna keep getting higher and higher after that and yeah honestly 2021 is gonna be a better year i hope than 2020 because you know a lot happened in 2020 but you know we gotta stay positive keep moving forward and just hope for better days like honestly that's all you can do it's already happened all you can do is just hope that things progress and things get better and yeah you guys so this is it for the video today you guys hopefully you enjoyed watching me try some new makeup get a little bit out of my comfort zone with the mats and hopefully you like how this came out honestly um i think it looks super gorgeous my face is not oily. I mean, the only thing that's shining is my highlight. So, <laughs> as it should be. I just want to say thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure you leave me a comment down below on what you think about this look. If you've tried the NARS foundation yourself, you know, what you thought about it, your opinions, your thoughts, all that. Um, let me know any suggestions in the comments or anything you guys would like to see from me. And yeah, I just want to say thank you for watching my video thank you for getting this far if you got this far thank you so much <laughs> sound like i'm out of breath <laughs> but yeah you guys thank you so much for watching make sure you give me a big like if you like this video make sure you leave me a comment down below and subscribe to your girl if you want more you know because that's the only way i'm gonna know that y'all like me <laughs> and you want to see more so make sure you subscribe if you want to see more of your girl and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye